Hey there. Welcome to Daily Dominion. We have another intrigue board. Because it's intrigue plus allies, but we only rolled one allies card. Now two allies cards. Um... There's no village effect. Just going to put a damper on what you can do here a little bit. So there is a good amount of gaining. I don't think we can really make garrison work, though. I, I'm always, I always love to try and make the, the forts do something. Um, especially against that bot, because they don't really continue. Well, they'll buy hill forts. They don't buy garrisons, but the AI will buy hill forts. Um, pretty much when at any time they're revealed, which is kind of funny. I don't actually know how that <laughs> comes up, but anyway. Um, garrison can draw a lot of cards, and it can even draw a lot of cards here, but you can only play one a turn, and then that would be your only terminal, and, you know... would maybe allow you to gain a lot of duchies, but it would be probably pretty slow. I'm trying to think how many... Because there are a lot of spammable cards to gain, so the, the gains are not really an issue. Um, then you would do upgrade stuff. You could certainly take a lot of duchies. It's just a question of, like... How many would be left at that point? Um, the alternative, I guess, is... Well, not alternative, but the alternative terminal to play. I think the decks would look pretty similar. You probably want a good amount of courier secret passages some upgrade in Ironworks. I think all that would be the core of any deck you play here. Um, but you would be sacrificing your ability to play Replace if you'd got, you went for the Garrisons. You'd also really need to, I guess you wouldn't have to, you could just gain them away. But none of that is like particularly fast to hitting five. I would just be worried there wouldn't be very many points. It would be the more more interesting deck to play here for sure. Would just be worried about the the amount of time you'd have to build it. And in the end, it would be okay at gaining estates and duchies. It just wouldn't be any good at gaining prov. I mean, it would be fine. It could be fine at gaining provinces. Like that wouldn't necessarily be the hold up. It would just be whether it was too slow. And I would be a little worried about the AI using replace to trash provinces to gain provinces to to speed up the end of the game. That would be my principal fear. So I think what I'm going to do here, an open courier silver. Hopefully we flip a copper. Yes. Okay. We'll buy an upgrade. We have a shot at we had a shot at double five, but we didn't quite get there. And now I'm going to take an iron works. Buy a torture, which I don't think is super good here. I mean, you can only play one of them. It certainly doesn't play all that well with courier. Well, I guess depending on when you draw the torture in your shuffle, it could play well with it because it could allow you to play two of them. So, I mean, that's fair. Like this here is a nice example of it. We play the upgrade in our first hand of the shuffle, and now we have courier so we can play... Well, also just we bought all these things so we can play one of them, but... um. I guess we'll play the replace is probably the best thing to play here. I don't know what to get on top. Courier is a little risky because we don't have the stuff in the discard, so I guess I'll just do a 
Um, what am I doing? I guess I'll just do a... I don't know that you want a lurker. You can do some things with lurker here, but... Since the draw is so weak... Um... I guess we're okay to discard here. Uh, we'll just put this down here. And now I feel not so bad about getting a courier. Since we have additional stuff in the discard now. Um... So this could, we could put a secret passage in there so that we know <clears throat> we can play all these couriers. I don't know what other cards we have. Uh, we can put a courier in there too. Um, or even an ironworks. That's actually maybe the most interesting. So there was a secret passage in there, so it was fine anyway, but we do the courier. Let me play courier. And this kind of lets us, you know, churn through more of the deck. Um, I guess I'll curse the bot. I mean, why not? I'm not sure silver is better than nothing. That's unclear to me. I think it's probably worse than the... It, I'm not, it's not totally clear because I don't know how controlled will really be once it's all done. Silver is a little underwhelming here. They're playing their torture pretty often, which is unfortunate. Sort of unfortunate. We can do, um, discard and upgrade. And then we just play. So we flipped an estate, which is fine. We can go ahead and get a silver. Buy another courier. Okay. So one thing here we may run into. They buy, they're buying duchies already, which is pretty promising for us because, of course, that's not really very good for their deck. We can think about replacing the ironworks. If I get another courier, we're going to run out of stuff to play. So maybe we get a secret passage. Like, we can play a couple of these, but then at some point we have to play... Um, like this courier, we're not going to play. We're going to play either a secret passage or an upgrade. Which I think maybe the secret passage is a little better. Um, I'm not sure that that was true. This will be fine. There's some couriers in here in Secret Passage, but we have tons of um, actions in the discard, though this isn't super great. What can we get? We'll have to play a Secret Passage, probably. This may... We could also... Well, no, we should at least try to get a little bit more. If we had drawn the courier before the secret passage, we would have get a little more play out of it, but it didn't quite work out. We could just play a replace. Um, which maybe is reasonable to do here. Put a secret passage on top. Now the question is, do we want like a gold for the purposes of replacing it in the province? I don't think we really want it for money per se, but we 
can also just be another upgrade. We still have two. Well, we're pretty well trashed out. Mm. The bot gave me a curse. I guess we have to put this secret passage on top to keep the keep the good times rolling. This isn't super good. Well, mainly, I mean, I would have expected to be able to get to eight here, but we do not. So, I don't really love giving getting the duchy, but since it gives a curse, it's okay. There's some world where we just three pile here. Okay, we have a lot of couriers in the discard now. Maybe worth not playing the iron. Well, okay. There's some world where we can like three pile here. Maybe. No, probably not. But it's not too far from happening. Okay, we can play one more courier and then we need to play like a secret passage. I mean, we can risk it, but there's no reason to. Okay. Put the upgrade on top. The trash. We still are kind of dying to get um, eight. Okay, well, this will work. Um, probably the curse is the most useful. We can trash it. So we get to eight there. Okay, that's not good. Well, um, yeah, this is not going well, actually. Partly is it that we only have seven couriers and eight would be a lot nicer. So now we have to find the silvers. Partly is that we're playing a lot of hand size decreasing stuff. Um, and partly it's just that, yeah, we're playing hand size decreasing stuff and there's not like loads and loads of um, Okay, put this at the bottom, I suppose. The only way we get further is if there's like mm, this is going to be annoying. The ironworks are a little annoying. Let's just put it at the bottom and I don't know if I want to risk it. It's actually still really hard to hit. Um
to hit seven here. Or to hit eight, I mean. So we didn't even find the two. Oh, man. We can lower, but that's risky. So it may be what we have to do. And we we score some points here. I'm gonna have to take duchy, I guess. We could just take a gold. I mean, if the bot actually misses at some point, we can kind of get the points fixed. Which okay, it just missed. So um. Still have so many of these. And at some point, if you knew your deck contents, you could stop and just see what you got. Okay, this is nice. Um, we could just bottom deck a province, trash the estate for silver. Maybe we trash the upgrade for gold, actually. Anyway, we get to double province here, which probably is a good enough turn to mean we'll just make it. Um, now the question is, do we play both these ironworks before? It is lowering, which isn't necessarily safe, but... I don't think they pile out here we can certainly at least province here maybe double this should all be fine now actually this is probably just a guaranteed win in hand right we have two ironworks in the yeah this is just a win um, which we can either take right off the bat or we can I mean, it becomes less guaranteed if I don't just take it, of course. Um, we get up to... Okay, well, the end wasn't so close. I think I was... Yeah, I mean, they're pretty cursed. Yeah, their deck isn't actually very good. Once you replace one of the things, the marquee out, there's not really... I mean, they can do stuff occasionally, but there's it's not going to be consistent. Um, This was an interesting deck. Obviously, it ends up being a little awkward pretty often just because of the hand size stuff. But it was pretty fun um, and a nice, lots of nice courier stuff going on. Secret Passage Courier. Oh, I guess Courier's from Allies too, isn't it? All right, so that was the big Allies contributor here. 
Um, I think there was my 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 view on the deck would be that I think I needed to pivot out of some of the gaining maybe a little bit sooner. Um, because I really think I should be promising at least a turn or so sooner. Uh, and it would have been nice to have gold. Like we could have maybe replaced an ironworks into gold. Um, but we did end up with that nice double province turn. That was pretty good. Um, it was just a little uncontrolled. So anyway, interesting deck, not a not necessarily any power combo, but a lot of synergies and um, ultimately an engine looks pretty good to me here because it can deal with the curses better and it can potentially do multiple green gains in a turn, which straight money simply can't do here. Uh, all right, so thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll catch you tomorrow. Well, let's let's go to the thing. We're back to no, we're not. We're almost back to seven. Cross our fingers for tomorrow. See ya.